Hi, I'm Zach Noyle, 25 years old from Honolulu, Hawaii. I'm a surf photographer for Surfer Magazine. Growing up in Hawaii, you, you are constantly surrounded around the beach. Your daily activities, your weekends, your family events are all based around the water. My father is a commercial photographer, so using that ability of having the photography and my love for the ocean just came natural for me. As a surfer, going in the ocean, you see the beauty of the waves and underwater and the barrel and just the beauty of the islands. And finding a way that I could convey that to a normal person that wouldn't be going out in the waves or the water, like my mom or family or different things like that, was a, just a natural fit for me to be able to share with the other people. I did photography for several years as a hobby and would shoot pictures of my friends, go to Sandy Beach, just play around, small disposable camera, started upgrading slowly. I then started getting more and more interested in the professional side of it, of shooting professional surfers, selling gallery prints and different things. And it just kept progressing from there to where it is today. And it's kind of all happened really fast for me. And I still can't believe, you know, three years ago I was just shooting, playing at Sandy Beach and now I'm shooting for Surfer Magazine. I've kind of learned that where you need to train year round. And this is your job to be training to be in the best shape so that you can go into the water and perform at an optimal level. You're shooting these athletes, but in a sense you are an athlete too, where you have to be swimming out to 12 foot pipeline, big barrels, be diving, swimming, fighting the current, get yourself in, hold a 10 pound camera. I just kept working at it, shooting, proving myself swimming out to the crazy conditions, putting myself in crazy positions, and it's pretty amazing. I feel really lucky that I can do what I love and my family supports me. It's just been an amazing ride and I can never take it for granted. You just always gotta be thankful in what you have.